And Corey Maggetti is shaving. I might have to investigate oh, that play. My God, Michael, <laughs> I might have to well, investigate JaVale McGee this whole play. Oh my God. Be Watch this. Today. And I asked the question, where the hell are you going? <laughs> oh, you're an idiot. Where the hell are, are you, you going? Really? It's serious that you run back on defense when you still have the ball? What are you doing? Oh, Man, why are you not back in the play? No, Hustle no. back. Sub. Sub. Oh, back. They're really clumsy. <laughs> Donna, man down. Donna, man down. 3.30. Man down. Paul Silas never seen anything quite like that. He's man like he's down. Like, well, he's quite, quite clumsy. He rebounds, clips up 43-38. Rashad Lewis checks into the game, takes off his warm-up, and his jersey comes off with it. Shoots a free throw like I used to shoot it. Oh, that was awful. And that was his first free throw attempt. Could have been his first. The mask guard jumps a little too early for Ooh. a dunker tip and just gives it away. A <laughs> <laughs> couple of two random fans seated in between Delonte West and Vince Carter. Now, this is in Detroit. So maybe this is some kind of ploy to throw the defending champs uh, off their game, maybe. I don't know. But look at the face of, of Vince Carter. I don't know if these guys smell or they're telling bad jokes, but Vince wants no part of this on the bench. Where can I go? Somebody, please. Get him a tic tac. Long time for the Lakers. And what was Powell what was was Saul doing? Thinking? Uh oh, look at this man scramble. Boom, boom. And guess who, oh, guess who is in there hustling? 18 15. Then Evan Turner. Well, yeah, that'll count. Even though it was supposed to be a pass, it counts as a three pointer, and his teammates love it. We are tied at 25. And yeah, just to lost nine straight against the Magic. Longest active losing streak against any team. Fourth quarter, Chauncey Billups. Hurts his left ankle. It looks like it turns out to be an Achilles injury on the Playing against his hometown team. He playing in his first game since January 4th and came off the bench. Now, dang, no, it won. Now, A.J. Price sets up the offense and check out this. It's not April Fool's Day. It's the power of going out in Indiana. Avery Johnson laughing about it with Joey Crawford, and the lights would come back on, and the play would result. And New Orleans would hit a few from the line to seal the deal. New Orleans goes on to win. I some talk to their coaching staff, and they, they are really pleased with where they are right now. So there was that. They, they, the air ball and the three-point attempt. They, they, yeah. Cleveland fans had that to cheer for. It's a team record 12 blocks. Singleton steal. And this is a breakaway dunk. Oh, yikes. And that'll come back to haunt them. Florida State product. Little levity early on. Matt Barnes, two-handed jam, and he misses. You know what? The Warriors equal to the challenge at the other end. Kwame Brown, the former Laker, misses the two-handed jam. Nice night for the Nets. Darren Williams looking to make the touchdown pass to Anthony Morrow. Well, that wasn't very good. That's trailing by three. Dragic had the hot hand. But he just threw it away there, and that was that. Houston threw away its chance. Now, Ellis is a warrior god, but he is not perfect as he misses the jam. And Jackson, smiling, said, I never did that. Of course, he never jammed one. Westbrook, final seconds of the second quarter, going to jam it on down. No. Wooden West was huge in this game. Watch him here on the fast break. Off the steal. He had five steals in the game. Misses the flush. Replay to follow here. Detroit, eight turnovers. West, uh, he would make up for that later. Just trust me on that one. And so the Grizzlies, a chance to tie. 30 seconds to go after a timeout. Rudy Gay, baseline. He's bottled up, and he loses the ball out of bounds. Oh, the Thunder ice it with free throws for the Grizzlies. They were so close to tying it or maybe getting a win, but it slips out of their hands. 195, the final. Eight assists. Mike James got the call up today to come to Chicago with Derrick Rose. Out. Didn't even have a name on his jersey, but it didn't matter. The Bulls win it by 14. Two free throws. We go to the other end, and immediately, Jamal McGlure is fouled. He's a 14% free throw shooter this year. He missed them both. Keep in mind, for his career, 
He is a 64% free throw shooter. That free throw, frankly, an air ball. Gloves lamp. Watch as they go back up court. James Johnson stumbles and falls on Leandro Barbosa. He rolls his ankle. There it is one more time. He left the game and went to the locker room. So you're going to want to stick and stay with NBA.com to get any updates on John. And early on, you pay attention to Rudy Gay. Look at this easy. No! Huge miss. That certainly would have made the top ten had Rudy Gay pulled that one down. Instead, off the back of the rim and out of bounds. So the big loser there, Rudy Gay, not in the top ten on that play. Later, two as we dig into Kobe Bryant's night, and it wasn't vintage Kobe on this night. Mid third quarter, and Kobe turning it over. He had four turnovers on the night. Then he gets into the lane, lefty shot, nearly an air ball, and then Kobe gets a screen from Josh McRoberts. He doesn't want that screen, and he misses the shot against seven. 59-57 at that point. Jason Maxeal. Mm. Oh, my God. Somebody close that window. Uh. So Raymond Felton going the other way with a chance to tie it, but he loses the ball and in doing so gives Detroit the win. Yeah, that makes Greg Monroe happy. That one home in Boston opening up a big margin, 56-41 later. Four players on the court for the Magic. Perhaps that's the problem. Look, Jason Richardson recognizes it, gets in the game, and poof, out of nowhere, he knocks the ball out of bounds off Greg Stiesma. Smile on J.J. Reddick's face, and yeah, Jason Richardson checks himself right back out of the game. Into the feet of 53 outside, Sean Marion. Somehow that shot goes in. It doesn't look great, but the result is terrific. There it is again, and it goes down 4-6 from distance. Dallas up 70 to 50. Rodrigue Beaubois on the breakout, and he gets just ripped down by Telfair. Watch it one more time. Telfair with his left hand grabs his jersey, maybe trying to help him just a little bit on that play, but Telfair is ejected from the game, and yet yeah, he's frustrated.